when I stood before you and Nigerians and declared my interest to run for the office of the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. In that statement, I made a commitment to five issues. One, to pledge to unify this country. And that was why I referred myself as a unifier. The reason why I feel and I felt that unity is very important for us is because the government of the APC has disunited Nigerians completely between North and South, East and West, Muslims and Christians. And I therefore pledge that I will work to ensure I restore unity and I give a sense of belonging to all Nigerians irrespective of their places of origin and irrespective of the faith they practice. I also committed that I was going to deal decisively with our security challenges in this country. I also pledge to confront our economic challenges which were all caused by the APC government. The PDP made Nigeria one of the most prosperous or if not the prosperous country on the African continent. We implemented economic reforms that brought about jobs, that brought about prosperity in this country. The APC came and wiped out all those gains. Ladies and gentlemen, that's why I said today is a very, very historic day because it is going to give us an opportunity for us to reverse all the misgovernance of the APC government. Let me also use this opportunity to call on my fellow contestants and to assure them that I'm ready to cooperate and work with them and give them a sense of belonging in this party and our next government. Therefore, my fellow compatriots, I want to appreciate your efforts in deepening our democratic processes in this party. It was a well-fought primary elections. So I commend you for that, and I look forward to working with you very closely so that together we can build this party to a level where we can take over the government. As I said earlier on in my remarks, I want to appeal to all agreed members of our party that they should please return to our party and we are willing, we are ready, the leadership of the party, our governors and myself to make sure that their grievances are resolved within the party. Let me also appeal to agree party members. There are internal mechanisms to resolve all disputes in this party. Let us make use of those internal mechanisms to resolve our disputes in our party instead of going to various law courts and getting contradictory rulings and contradictory judgments. It is not going to over well for the growth of our party. Our party is a very, very democratic party. It has internal mechanisms to resolve all disputes. 
therefore I call on all members of our party to make use of those internal mechanisms. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please, please in the name of God, let us remember the poor people of this country, the ordinary people of this country. Let us work to resolve most of their challenges, if not all of their challenges. Once again, I want to extend my gratitude to the leadership of our party, to our governors who have worked day and night to ensure that this convention holds. I pray that from today, this party will continue to work stronger and stronger by the day. Therefore, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I cannot end my remarks without saying, God bless you all. PDP! PDP! Power to the people! Thank you. Thank you very much, Your Excellency. May we now invite the Secretary of the National Convention Planning Committee, His Excellency, Governor Shona, to formally propose the vote of thanks. Congratulations. The Secretary of the Convention Committee, Governor Shema, will now make the vote of thanks for this convention. With gratitude, Almighty God, who knows what will be before it comes to be. I would like to express the appreciation of our great party, the PDP, and a thank you to all members of our party, our leaders, our parents, and great sons of Nigeria for a successful event that has just been held today, which is very historic. This indeed, I say a big congratulations to all of us and our newly emerged elected provincial candidate, Aladi Atiku Abubakar, who will fly our party's flag.